today is July 14th and this is my updated garden tour. We just planted some ox heart carrots. They haven't popped up yet. The burdock leaves are getting really enormous. So are the carrots. The radishes have bolted but their pods are really really delicious. Like this. I harvested a ton of bok choy, and this is what's left of it. Still another harvest. This one's bolting, so I'll get seeds from it. I recently weeded all of the mints, peppermint, spearmint, lemon mint, apple mint, spear pepper, chocolate, and pineapple. Up here we have the nasturtiums. And these are the seeds I'm starting this fall. I've got so far one big zucchini. All the lettuce and endive have already come up. And that's my catnip looking a little sad. I recently harvested the kale and spinach. And then we have one cucumel in here and some cilantro. More kale here that was harvested bok choy and the lettuce is getting a little bigger. Here we have one potato we haven't harvested yet and then the flower bed, one sunflower, a few blackberries, hostas and wild violets, service berries and shampoo ginger getting a lot bigger. The mother of thousands is getting huge. And the sweet potatoes have produced slips. I've already taken four off of them. Here we have Nolan's hops. And tonight we harvested quite a few cones from them. So that's what they look like. This one's almost ready. And then we have the Zucchini and butternuts, the mini melons. We just moved, this zucchini is not broken, we just moved it up so it can get a little more light and it was falling into the fence. A butternut I believe is probably ready but it's a little small. Another watermelon in there. And I'm not sure what this is, it's supposed to be a butternut but it may have been crossed with something. Then we have the large potatoes, the soybeans, and then a black beauty or a black diamond watermelon. And then this was the barley. It's got a lot of grass in it right now. Then of course all of the sunflowers. Another mini melon. All of these are watermelons. And then these are the cucumbers, the geltros, the green dragon, a few munchers. And these are the cucumelons, sage, pineapple sage, strawberries, parsley, dill. Nolan's working on the Florida weave for the peach tomatoes. We have some basil, marigold, little ones in the pots. And then we have our main tomato bed. We put some bags around them to keep them protected. Then we have just a little basil bed. And all the way over here, we have our okra. I just picked a big one off of it. There are a few more there. And this is the corn. It's starting to get silks here. So it's doing pretty good. This is the pink and blue Hopi corn. 
and then in the middle is the glass gym nothing on the glass gym yet it may have to get a little taller and then the sweet corn nothing on the sweet corn yet either well, we recently built this trellis for all of the other cucumbers, the lemon cucumbers, the crystal apples, um, and a few melons to grow up this because they were getting a little out of hand. So you can see there's a cucumber right there. It turns out I have another watermelon and a few of the mortgage lifters grown from suckers. I also have two sad little okra here trying to take off. All right, and then on this side, this is the only yellow squash that I planted this year. It's just the yellow scallop. It's coming back. And then on this side, more cucumbers. And then this was our harvest earlier tonight lots of tomatoes crystal apple cucumbers peach tomatoes and finally we've started to get some bell peppers there are a few in there and then no loofah flowers yet and this is just the second tomato bed And the last thing we have through here are the tomatillos. They're getting pretty big. Not quite ripe just yet though.